it's hard to sell for myself. But through mobile phone, it's easier because I cannot use that money at that time. We always buy uh, fertilizer. They have taught us how to make our own. <laughs> Okay, my name is Wickliff. I'm the program manager of Kakameka Rural Development Program, an organization that is community based. We started a uh, a forum for farmers, small-scale farmers, to save their money easily and to do to borrow some small loans for themselves, so that they ca it can help them solve their daily issues. So, majorly, as we focus on empowering them to in raise their living standards. Number one, we are able to identify a network with Safaricom, which was to help us make sure that we reach to farmers who are owning phones. So after doing our research, we had a baseline survey which showed that uh, all farmers in Kakamega County, at least 95%, are owning a phone. And then another, another thing, as you, you see me holding this paper, we registered a number, 8596.99. This is a, a number that is hosting Kakamega Rural Development Program in Safaricom Network. I start saving with cattle. They give me some cash. I bought eggs and then I start um, hiking this very few hands here. We got to know about Kadeb through there's a local radio there's a radio station most most FM where they normally give uh, they educate people about the savings and how to do organic farming. So when we heard about them on radio we conducted them and they were very quick they came they gave us they came they met us here and then they taught us on how to start the savings so as an organization we are able to tell farmers to identify themselves with the id number so a farmer is able to use a, uh, the id number as a county number to identify him or herself with the GADAP. so this system has helped them to enter the same and uh, after entering the, the account number, the, another option comes where she, he or she has to enter the amount. You choose any amount you want to save. Like with me, I can save 50 shillings. Okay. Then I'm pass up your number. Then it brings you a message. Either if you want to continue with the process that you cancel. So you press OK. So like yesterday I sold a crate of eggs at uh, 450. So I want to say 450. I'm saving a little. It is not a lot. It is just a little. But it is still small. It's around 3000 over 2 years. So if I save I get like 5,000 or 6,000 it can be paid. When I just saw some money, they demanded to use the juice. They said, "Come on, we can make." But I can't handle it now. Because December, we keep at it December until we come to the school this in January. At first, I had some challenges because you save and you don't know how to get uh, the money. My problem or my challenge is. I don't have shelter for them. Also food, to buy food for them is very difficult. At the moment they are having some few challenges because not all farmers access the e-banking as M-Pesa points are supposed to be in every working location. But you might find also that distance is not yet so much close to them. You might have some who are working like two kilometers or sometimes others they might go short of things like battery. They he wants to save, his phone is not working, so he doesn't have electricity to charge, he'll save tomorrow or next week and you know the challenges of money. 
the problem that we have here is feeding to, to get the food for the, the poultry. I use local foods, e.g. omena, uh, the remains of fish, uh, remains of uh, coconut, uh, ground nuts. Now, when you are, you are short of, uh, let me say, meals, eh? or, or food for the poultry, you just switch on and you are given. You, you, you ask for the amount you want to go and buy the foods, and then you are given. Kadeb assisted us to come together and uh, taught us about uh, organic farming. They gave us some magazines. We, learned, we, we, we read those magazines and uh, we got the information. <laughs> We had challenges before, like the distance towards the bank or the urban areas, and also the rates at the bank, and also when they take loans from the bank, the banks could actually uh, interfere with their daily activities, like they could come when they are defaulters, they harass them, actually. The banks are business-oriented, they want to gain the profit, so here we are not a business-oriented organization, we are development-oriented. When you save in the bank, there's that deduction of, uh, but if you save through the phone, there's no deduction. Yeah. I'm just thinking that if at all I will success saving, is when I will get a thick shelter and to have many uh, parts. Mm. Because this is few. Though others are outside, but these are few. I want to have them in a good number so that if I can save, I can get the school fees. Also, even farming, it is difficult for me. The biggest challenge we had before very many other organizations and uh, other groups came and cheated farmers that they can save with them, then the organization ran away with the farmer's money. So when we came with the idea, the farmers still doubted if this is still the same project like the one that came before. Uh, they were not actually having the full trust until we had to prove to them that we are actually your own born people, we are actually from you and we cannot con you. We used to fear, but right now we are safe. At the times we use our own experience as uh, old mamas. Because you don't rely always on books, you rely on your brain at times.